Revelation chapter 13. Verse 16 and it reads, and he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a M-A-R-K in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save, save he that had the M-A-R-K or the name of the beast or the number of his name. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash, next double honors to the head apostles, slash elder bishops of great millstone, the ones that taught us the 100% truth according to the Bible. Peace, blessings, and safety to all you sincere items. Keep pushing, keep believing, keep the faith. Regardless of people here for a bear, let us not sleep as others. Everybody's in the so called holiday spirit, living carelessly living recklessly ain't paying attention to nothing that's going on even though when they go to these different stores or whatever they do to the to the bank to the gas station to the car wash everything is c-hip ready ready everything is c-hip ready no they're not even paying attention they just think it's just ooh, ooh, uh, um an easier way to pay for things yeah, that's their only mindset. They don't even know no saying that it's to further put them in, in, in slavery, in prison, so to speak. You see, everything is going digital. Now people don't even know what the hell is going on. Look, this man is getting ready, this devil, this deceiver, this slanderer is getting ready to make it mandatory that you take an implantable device. In order to buy and sell, in order to you forget, in order for you to get them gifts. In order for you to get water, all right? In order for you to have running water in your house, electricity in your house, food in your house, you, 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 you still gas in your car, pebbles on your baby's butt, but you see, shirt, socks, shoes. In order to for you to have these things, unless you got your own factory, which which, which if, if you got that, you know what I'm saying, your little mom and pop store, look, that's not going to be able to run without the implantable device. Let us not sleep as others. We do, this is going to be made mandatory, Israel. Keep your eyes open. Watch as well as pray that we're kind of worthy to escape all these terrible things that's coming down the pipeline. The Bible is not all, a book of all love, love. It's not all lovey-dovey, Israel. And the Lord said, give them warning. This devil's going to put a C-hip, a karagma in you in order for you to function in society. And we, we go through this all the time. In order for you to, to function and pretty much maneuver in a digital society, you must have, you must take a digital device, right? But, but, you, but you don't get that, right? It's, it's, it's a lot of fun. So just have, so just have fun, right? Just have fun, play your music, and ignore everything that's right in front of your face, right? Ignore what you see, right? Yeah, just, look, just ignore reality, right? Revelation chapter 13, verse 16. And he, the he is the elites, man. The elite banking families. And on top of all that, you got wars, storms, floods, chaos, mayhem, civil war, civil unrest, the economy is crashing, hyperinflation, then kicked in, the love of many is rising cold. But the only thing you think about is some damn holiday gifts and holiday cheers and glees and things. You it's like so gone, man. You, you're really gone. You you're just ignoring everything that's happening on the earth right about now. You see? Your mind's focused on one thing, and it's a damn Christmas and a damn new year, so-called new year. You ain't focused on nothing shit at, at the so-called beginning of the so-called new year. This this devil's going to pass probably about 60,000 more laws to take away your quote-unquote, the, the rest of your so-called rights. You, 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 you have no clue. Robot dogs, robot uh, men, robots, robots, dogs, you know what I'm saying, with blickies on the top of it. Tanks are going to be coming down your street, but but now, nah, long, long as Christmas is involved and Santa Claus and reindeers and bright lights and shit, that's the only thing you see right about now. You don't see nothing else. Let us not sleep as others. And he calls of all, all means all, both small and great, rich and poor. This is pretty much going to everybody on the face of the earth, free and bond, whether you're walking around the streets or whether you're locked up. This is everybody. When it says all, it means all Israel. You're not going to be able to escape this. You see, 
to receive a M-A-R-K, a karagma. You see, an imprinted M-A-R-K, something being inserted inside of you, right? You, you see it right here, something the size of, of a grain of rice. It's going to have your ID on. Oh, yeah, but it's June, though, right? Is you going go, still going with that narrative, right? It's June. The bombs don't listen to the bombs, right? You still gonna go with that. You gonna go with that until they knock on your door, right? You mean tell me you gonna keep listening to that nonsense until they actually knock on your door, right? And, and say, "Excuse me, sir," or, or "Excuse me, miss," and they, and they, they coming in. They gonna play nice with you, but um, but soon come it's gonna turn up. Look, look, within a hot second, it's gonna turn up. You see, they they, they gonna want to know what you gonna do. You see. What you going to do? Do you want to function in society? Do you want to keep thriving in society? Well, you, you know what you're going to have to do. If not, no. So you see that, you see that bus out there? See, see that see that bus, like that big, long-ass bus? See all them buses, you know what I'm saying, lined up on that street? If you don't want to take this c hip, this digital um device, then you, you can just hop on that bus right there and we'll take you someplace, you know what I'm saying, till you, till you figure out what you're going to do. That, that's what our people are going to be favoring. It's going to get dark soon come. It's going to get dark and gloomy soon come, right? The, the music is going to stop Israel to receive a M-A-R-K, a karagma, in their right hand or in their forehead. And the Lord said, give them one. What we, what we do, we're giving you one. We're giving you one of what is going to happen. It ain't, it ain't um if... It's when, Israel. Look, look, and that no man or woman might buy or sell. And our people love buying. In these stores, they love to sell you stuff too, right? So, so just imagine you not being able to purchase anything without having a device inserted inside of you. And, and, and don't think it's far-fetched. Why do you, you Israelites are, are gone in the head. You think it's far-fetched that this devil can do it. He can't do that. You you said that about the Capri Sun. You said he couldn't make you drink that Capri Sun. You said he couldn't stop you from going in a restaurant. You said he couldn't stop you from going to the gym. You see? He said you said he couldn't stop you from working. You said he couldn't stop you from driving down the damn belt line. He shut everything down. He's gonna do it again. And uh, um, another false flag, another um pandemic, no saying, and and, look, and shit going back to how it was in twenty twenty. But you ain't gotta believe us, though, right? And that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the M A R K, the karagma. So if you ain't got the karagma, you're not gonna be able to buy. And in the, the stores that don't have the technology, you're not gonna be able to sell. This this is real. You see, and, and like I was going into in the beginning of the video, pretty much every store is C hip ready. Even the mom and pop stores. You see, they didn't went around. So you see, so our people, they 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 late to their own funeral, so to speak. They didn't went around to pretty much all the stores, letting them know what was going to be the new wave. You see, or, or or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. And look, look, and we're not ignorant. We're giving you warning. What you see on the screen, they're going to make it mandatory that you take it. Here go, here go another picture. That, that right there. You see? It, you, it's not going to be something long, a long surgical process and all that. That's why we're constantly praying to you. How about Hashem Yahushua? What, what is it? Um, Revelation 3 and 10. Let's just get this. You know, the Israelites, they, they don't believe nothing. Too, too busy having fun, right? Too busy dancing, shaking their dreads. And you Israelite groups look through his head with them damn long ass dread too, them shatters. You know what I'm saying? Them shatters. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 look, you look crazy as hell. You look demonic. You see, you look dark. You look sinister. The men and the women. That ain't our culture. They are damn dread heads, man. We're we going to call you dead heads, man. Revelation chapter 3, verse 10. Let's see if them, them dreads, you know what I'm saying, get you out of trouble when all hell break loose. You see? The same thing that you see going over there, you know what I'm saying, in the east, you know what I'm saying, it's going to come over here. But oh yeah, holiday travels, holiday travels. Man, it's going to be a whole lot of people getting deleted. Those spirits created for vengeance, they're active. They're waiting for you to come out of town. Those spirits that are created for vengeance, they're waiting on you to get on that damn plane and take your ass to, to another country or to another city and stay there. They're waiting on you, man. Revelation chapter 3, verse 10. In this um, red letter, lawyer, how was I speaking? What they even call Jesus, right? Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, you suffer. He that endureth it to the end, the same shall be saved, right? And my phone just went up. It's all about suffering. We, we're going to suffer. You know that. I also, and then this devil said, you ain't going to be able to buy or sell, but the Lord said, my servant's going to eat. Just, just constantly remind yourself of, of what the Lord said. Yeah, this devil, this, this, this slanderer, this deceiver, he said one thing, but what did Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai say? What did our power say? The devil said, you're not going to be able to buy or sell, you're not going to be able to get no food, you're not going to be able to get this, you ain't going to be able to get that. But what did the Lord say? The Lord said, I'm going to take care of you, you ain't got to worry about that. You see? 
because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation. And when you go into the definition of temptation, it's pretty much someone trying to lure you into doing some evil. Matter of fact, we'll, we'll get it. And the scriptures tell us when you come to serve the Lord, prepare thy soul for temptation. It tells you that in Sarah, in Sarah. The second chapter is starting right at the top. Let's play it. Temptation. Temptation. The desire to do something, especially something wrong or unwise. And that's exactly what this devil is going to try to get you to do. To do something unwise. He's going to try to get you to take an, an implantable device when the scriptures command us not to do it. And that's Israel in a nutshell. The Lord commands them to do something. They do the opposite. They say, no, nah, he, 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 he don't see me right about now when the eyes of the Lord are 10,000 times brighter than the sun. And you're going to have your average Israelite group leader, you know what I'm saying, push forth this too. Because they're trying to say this ain't this ain't the um the M-A-R-K of the beast. They're saying it's sin. It's, um, it's sleeping with a white woman. So they're going to say, as long as you don't sleep with a white woman, you can take this right here, right? You see, as uh, long as you don't read John 3, 16, you could take this right here, right? That, that's going to be their narrative, man. You, you, you got to eat, don't you? I got to eat, too. You got to eat, right? You Israelites, if, man. Right, look, look, look. The scriptures say, redeem the time because the days are evil. It's high time to awake out of sleep. And, and another scripture says, um... Uh, discern pretty much who's serving the Lord or who ain't. You better get your discern on. Revelation chapter 3 verse 10 because thou hast kept the word of my patience I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation. When, when someone's going to try to lure you or, or convince you. You know what I'm saying? You see? Or um, What's the word? Uh, the word escapes me right about now. To, to take this C-hip, this implantable device. Your, they, your, uh, uh, your wife might try to do it but Baby, baby, the baby need a baby Baby, darling, I need you And all this other nonsense We need you, baby no, see, we, the, the baby hungry, I'm hungry We ain't ate it, we ain't ate in three hours What? How people are weak and feeble, you know what I'm saying? They ain't got no faith in your house, but she may shot. So, so it, it doesn't matter if, it, if, it's a, if it's an hour, if it's a day They're going to take that sea hip the Lord said, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. The Lord said it's going to come upon all the world. So why these other Israelites are playing around? They, they don't even bring it out. They, they, you don't never see them bringing out this scripture. You don't never see the average Israelite group bring out that scripture. They, they, they too busy doing debates. They're too busy. Husband loves that. Why they're too busy performing marriages and weddings and all this other BS. Which, which is a time and a season for all that, but this, this ain't the time. This ain't the time and this ain't the season to be for performing no damn weddings, man. You see, all hell breaking loose, and, and this is going to be made mandatory. But oh yeah, come, coming in that jagged edge spirit, I just want to get married, meet me at the altar, and all this other nonsense, right? Oh yeah, I want to, I want to get married. Can you perform a wedding? You know what I'm saying before, before 2024 come in, what 2024 come in? Can you perform a wedding for us? You, you just like it's gone. Second Corinthians chapter two verse eleven. At least Satan, the word Satan means adversary, should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant. For we, the whole for elect, we are not ignorant of his devices. The word ignorant means not to know. Look, look, we we know what it is. You're not going to be able to take your cruises. I can't forget that. You're not going to be able to get on the cruise ship. You're not going to be able to get on the plane. You're not going to be on to get on the, the transit, the transit city bus. You're not going to be able to take an Uber. All that, all that, everything is going digital. And we're not ignorant of Satan devices. Going to the definition of devices, tricks, his schemes, his plots, man. We got your Howard Baha Shem Shah on our side, man. It's, it's, it's a beautiful thing. All hell breaking loose. And the Lord said, don't even worry about it. He coming with his nonsense, but look, don't even worry about it. What is that? Um, Psalms. Is it 78? Um, jeez. Bear with me. Psalm chapter 37, verse 7. Um, see, everybody's caught up in the Christmas spirit and the so-called New Year's, you know what I'm saying? But what are the men of the Lord doing? We warning you through the spirit of Yahweh, Baha Shem Yahweh. We, we got to stay, stay on this thing right here, right? Because this is going to be made mandatory soon come, right? Psalm chapter 37, verse 7. It reads, rest in the Lord within the comforter, within this word. Because pursuant to Micah 2 and 10, this is not our rest. You see, this devil is going to make this mandatory Israel, but you ain't got to take our word for it, right? Rest in the Lord, talking to the whole full elect of the nation of Israel, which consists of your so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Macanese, 
by the seed of your father, right? And the Israelites have been scattered throughout the four corners of the earth. They may look like these heathens, but your seed line goes back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, right? Rest in the Lord and wait patiently. Look, we read earlier, uh, Revelation 3 and 10, because I have suffered, you know what I'm saying? Um, because thou has kept the patience, which goes back to being to suffering. The Lord said, and wait patiently, meaning we got to wait and suffer patiently. You see, we got to suffer, right? For him, to the Lord to come. Fret not, don't worry yourself. Fret not thyself because of him who prospered in his way. You know, the earth was given into the hands of the wicked. So he's prospering right about now, right? Because of the man who bringeth wicked devices to pass. And this is a wicked device. Making it mandatory that someone take an implantable device in order to buy and sell. And this right here is going to have your bank information, your social security card, your ID, all your information. And every time you went to the hospital, everything about you is going to be on this little, 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 itty, bitty, 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 bitty thing the size of a grain of rice. All your information, man. So I just want to do something quick. I'm about to head. I'm about to go get this daily bread. Lord willing, may your howl by Hashem Yabashah protect each and every last one of us. Hope for elects throughout the day, Lord's will. This is going to be made mandatory, Israel. Why everybody's singing and dancing and, and drinking eggnog and all that. This devil is, is uh, preparing to bring this thing to pass. It's, it's scriptural. This is this is scriptural. And, and, and I read, I, I quote, I quoted it. Let us not sleep. Matter of fact, I, I, I got to get it right quick. I gotta get it. Then I'm, then I'm gone because I gotta I gotta roll, man. What well look, we, we one day closer, Israel. We ain't gonna be working for this devil all way. We ain't got to worry about him trying to make it mandatory that we take an implantable device in order to buy and say, look, man, we ain't gonna have to keep going to him for the one of all things. It's almost over, man. First Thessalonians chapter five. That's one, one, one quick scripture. First Thessalonians chapter five, verse six. Let us, the whole for elect, let us, therefore let us not sleep. You see, we got to stay woke, man. We got we to stay watching, right? Therefore, let us not sleep as others do. The majority of our people, they don't know what the hell going on. Pretty much everybody in my job, they don't know what the hell going on. They don't know this, they don't know this man getting rid of this. The majority of my family members, they don't know what the hell going on. They don't know that this devil's getting ready to make the deceiver, the slanderer. Not a mythical creature up under the ground. They don't know that this devil's getting ready to make it mandatory that they're taking a implantable device in order to buy and sell. They don't know that in order to get them wigs. In order to get them wigs and tampons, you know I'm saying them, them snacks, you see, uh, uh, anyway, whatever, you see, all changes, you know, whatever, going out of town on a plane, getting on a train, they, they don't know that this devil's going to make it mandatory that they're taking an implantable device to function in society. But look, but we do. First Thessalonians chapter five verse six. Therefore, let us not sleep as others do, but let us watch and be sober spiritually. We got to watch Israel. Let us not sleep as others. Shalom.